With the state baseball championships on the horizon, the Sacred Heart Eagles are ready to return to the big stage. This team bringing plenty of experience to the table, including a group who competed for a state title just months ago. For the fifth time in program history, the Sacred Heart baseball team is returning to the state tournament. The Eagles winning the Section 8 Single A championship to punch their ticket to the big dance. For Sacred Heart, this is a return to form after falling just one game short last season. Last year was a big disappointment that we fell and we knew we just had to regroup and come back and now we're pretty excited that we got to our goal, but we have a good team and I think we could go pretty far once we go down at that tournament. If we play our game, then I mean nobody's going to beat us. So. Uh, we're a pretty talented group. Every everyone in our lineup, one through nine hitters, can I mean hit the ball over the fence, as you saw. So um, it'll be be fun to see and show people what we can do down there. This team features a group of players who are certainly no strangers to the postseason. As a matter of fact, there are 10 members of the roster who made history just three months ago. There are members of the Sacred Heart basketball team who made their first ever state tournament appearance earlier this spring. The camaraderie that they built on the hardwood moving seamlessly onto the diamond. From the beginning of school till the end, we're together. We're hanging out in class, small classes, so we all see each other every grade. Just, yeah. Being together all year, that friendship stays, even, you know, you have those times where you get mad at each other, get annoyed at each other, but it all works out and we're all great friends. It makes it a lot more fun and you can carry inside jokes that you had from one sport to another, so it, it's a lot of fun. So it's pretty cool that we have a lot of those same guys from that basketball team on this baseball team too. Some athletes go their entire high school careers without ever going to a state tournament. The fact that these players are about to go to their second in three months isn't lost on these multi-sport athletes. That's Pretty cool to be part of, and I'm excited to see where this leads, and hopefully we do well when we go down to that tournament too. So I'm pretty blessed to be part of that because it doesn't happen very often, so I'm pretty excited to see what we can do down there. We'll look back on it a few years down the road and realize, yeah, we had a pretty special team, and so um, it was, it's an honor to be a part of it, and uh, you know your name will go down in history, so that's a good feeling. The last, the last time Sacred Heart reached this tournament in 2019, they finished as runners-up. They have a chance to win the first state baseball title in program history starting tomorrow.